وما يجحد بآياتنا إلا الظالمون. Guys, cry with me. وما يجحد بآياتنا. رب جعلني مقيم الصلاة ومن ذريتي ربنا وتقبل دعاء. Now don't get me wrong at all, uni is not what I expected it to be and I always had this perception like it was some sort of school for that of adults with a strict teacher but Allah is so so different man, I can't lie. So now if you don't know, it's Muhammad Hamza, uh, the ex is actually a H in Somali and uh, somehow I'm a second year medical at Queen Mary University at London and I don't get some sort of high from this, you know what I'm saying? I mention it because there are some new viewers here and there that come to the channel and, and like I was saying, one thing you don't clock living in London is that, alhamdulillah we have it so easy man and the eye that I repeat in every single video or nearly every single video is وَمَا بِكُمْ مِنْ نِعْمَةٍ فَمِنَ اللَّهِ that there's not a single ni'mah that comes to you not a single blessing except that it's from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and you know I'm so so grateful man and studying medicine subhanAllah Imam Shafi'i puts it at such a high level and it is and I is like وَمِنْ أَجْلِي ذَلِكَ كَتَبْنَا عَلَى بَنِي إِسْرَائِيلِ until the segment which is relevant and the fact that in uni you have all the facilities to practice deen they give you wudu taps a prayer space you know even that I've been probably brothers brought it to be fair but even that chair that you can just it's like a foldable chair you're sitting down you're reclining and wallah is pretty techy Allah probably tell him super gassed I think it's probably one of the first times me using it in the video so yeah and even better than that is some of the conversations you're able to have with some of the brothers who wallah out of their wisdom and years of studying they're able to give you some seriousness you know what I'm trying to say and on top of that you see their commitment to prayer and even at times of academic struggle wallah they're there for you Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala facilitates ease from them for you you know what I'm trying to say with them for you that's probably bad english to be fair um and allah subhanahu wa ta'ala doesn't burden us so more than it has already been ordained for it and allah subhanahu wa ta'ala makes things hard easy <laughs> And on top of that, you can have a massive laugh with the brothers, man. Joma is also provided on campus where you see a lot of brothers come through, and you're constantly reminded that the wine, the girls, the haram income is not worth more than that of the contentment of the heart. Never mind that of paradise. كانت لهم جزاء كانت لهم جزاء ومصيرا and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala only invites you to something that's good for you the place of peace والله يدعو إلى دار السلام والله يدعو Zahe, make your request. Make a request. Make a request. Yeah. And being slap bang in East London, you also have the facilities to study Dean as well. Classes are left, right, centre. Monday, brothers say come to that of Ustad Jamal's class in East London Mosque. And on Wednesday, some brothers will say come to that of Ustad Ashik's class for that of Tilawa or that of Medina College if you signed up for it. Allahumma barik to some of the brothers. Then on Friday, Imam Nawi's Masjid and potentially that of Sunday, Bedal Academy. And I'm pretty sure there's tons and tons and tons of academies out there. But just to ensure that you follow one, that's on the Sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. There's no certification, there's no accreditation, there's nothing like this that has ever come to the beginning. A certification? Allah is at the beginning. The angel to be, Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, the Sahaba, the Salaf al Salih, after you go down, you go down, you go down, you see some of the names of people of our times that you may know. Ah, Sheikh Fulan is there, Sheikh Fulan is there. And they go in there. When you get to that level, inshallah, you will, and everybody here will as well. When you get to the temple, you would realize, why did I not start this a long time ago? 
Now, guys, if you don't know me, then now you're gonna get to know me. And that being said, uh, I always plug this class, but you still don't turn up, you lot, man. I May mean, Allah bless you lot. Literally, this Friday coming, the class is gonna begin the explanation of Thalatha Tul Usul, I believe so. And it's a new beginning, you know what I'm trying to say? So, some of the brothers that haven't attended, please, please, please come through for the sake of yourself. Brothers from that of Queen Mary University of London trek like a gang to get to the. Uh, Masjid, probably not the best description, but I'm saying they all come together, Allahumma barik, like a pack of wolves. May Allah bless them abundantly. And here's the hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. There's also a sister section where some sisters will also be coming from that of uni as well, inshallah ta'ala. So all I'm saying is get there early, man. Follow the Instagram page and the Telegram group to see if there's any cancellations last moment because this week it did get cancelled because the Ustad was sick. May Allah give him shifa, ameen. And if somehow you can't make it, then watch the dangerous ARH Abdurrahman. Hassan's explanation because wallahi off it's tacky you know what I'm trying to say so yeah man wallahi it's very very good Abdurrahman Hassan mm, you know what I'm trying to say Michel Tilik you know that's what the um, you know Egyptians would say but nonetheless may Allah bless you lot abundantly and all I'm saying is sometimes maybe it's not the most fun week in uni and metabolism is very fun but it can be a little bit draining so hence I've sort of stayed away from other medicine this week and uh, yeah man um, if you need medicine help go check out MedShark because it's still active uh, and what else is there to say you know what I'm trying to say make dua for me ask Allah to forgive me because I've got a lot of sins and you know may Allah help me get four wives I mean nah you know what I'm trying to say I mean nah you know but that being said, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Oh, my God.